everyone welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to do a little review and I guess packing of my Jade coach messenger bag I did receive this beautiful bag about a say a month or so ago and I have been using it quite a bit so I wanted to give an honest review about how I'm liking it what I fit inside so this is a beautiful full grain leather bag by coach it does have two different textures in the leather so the outside here like the flap here and the back side is like a pebbled leather and then there is a smoother leather in the front here there's like a square part of the bag this one does come with a short and long leather strap so this is the short strap here it does have some beautiful detailing on it as you can see with gold hardware the d-rings on here are really really nice very beautiful um, quality hardware on the coach bags all the coach bags i've ever received have really nice hardware just the quality is amazing d rings here there it does say coach as you can see engraved on there it does come with this little leather tab here that also says coach it also comes with a longer strap as well now the only thing i don't like about this particular strap is that it is quite thin and i am more of a thick strap girl so i haven't actually used this one but it is quite long uh, so it can cater for shorter or taller people. It does have a buckle adjustment right here. The gold hardware again. Really pretty, really good quality hardware. So I have used it with this shorter strap quite often. So here it is here where it sits on me. So it sits right underneath the armpit right here. And it's very, it's very comfortable. Um, I have used it quite a lot this way and have had no problems with it digging into my shoulder or anything like that. Now, if I want to wear this bag crossbody all over my shoulder, I have recently purchased a strap from Amazon, which I will, put, I will put the link down below so you guys can check it out. So this is a woven guitar strap and it only cost me, I think, I wanna say $20. And I received it the other day. I've been using it and it's very, very comfortable. See how much thicker it is? So I think it actually looks really, really good with this particular bag. It just depends on your preference, what kind of look you're going for. But if I do want to wear this one crossbody, this is a great option to use. One of the features, the aesthetic features that I love about the Coach Jade is this beautiful buckle kind of design in the front here. It has the horse and carriage. It's very, very good quality. I was uh, curious on how it would actually go being used, you know, on a regular basis as far as the way it connects into the leather. But so far it's been fabulous. No issues whatsoever. There is a really nice zipper on the back here. Nice smooth zippers. And the inside of here is a beautiful burgundy color, a burgundy kind of wine, I want to say. No feet on the bottom of this bag because it is more of a handbag. So the way that this bag opens is with this buckle here and a tab, a leather tab that actually slides in here. Now, see how I missed it just now? That's one thing I have noticed. Sometimes I do have to concentrate and kind of, you know, place it in behind that buckle and push it down, but it isn't hard to do. It's very, very easy to get in and out of the bag there. Uh, one thing I will note that I'm more, I'm, curious about and how this tab is going to go see how it it's it may end up kind of folding forward so far it's fine I try to kind of pull it straight up but if you're one of those people that like to kind of do this and you automatically want to pull it forward like this to put it back in uh, that could become a problem it could start bending forward but so far it just looks beautiful I haven't had any issues with that so I will go into the center of the bag now this is a pretty big flap it does have that micro suede or suede lining and the inside and it is that wine color again which is really really pretty so soft now this may look like a small bag but honestly i fit so much in here it opens up quite wide as you can see like this uh, so you can stuff it full if you wanted to but just be aware that when you close it it's going to look stuffed the way that it, it tapers here down to the bottom that kind of determines the shape so I wouldn't put too much in there because you it's just the way that it's shaped. I didn't want to I just noticed now actually that there on these rivets it actually does say coach. I don't know if you guys can see that, but just the details on these bags are amazing. So in the very front here on this smooth leather portion here, the rest is pebbled, but this is smooth, is a pocket. So I will note that my 
iPhone, uh, what's this, 11 Pro will fit into that pocket here uh, if I wanted to use it, or it also fits in the back of zipper pocket as well. But just normally I just kind of chuck it into the main section of the bag. It's easy to get it in and out of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move the camera up a little bit so you can get a better view of the inside of the bag so you can actually see how my things uh, fit and lay inside so, of this bag here. As I said, you open this up here. There is a pretty big opening here. It, see how see how wide that opens? It's really, really cool. Uh, I do use this as a handbag, as I said, but I have found that everything that I normally carry, even my white pouch and everything fits perfect in here. So the inside organization, there's one slip pocket back here and on here you do have the uh, little thing that says coach um you know it's a genuine leather thing this is a coach bag the blah 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 it's that whole spiel that's on every one of their little tags so they're just you know it's an authenticity thing to see you know that this is a coach bag an original coach and back here i just have my little uh neutrogena lip pencil gloss thing and then the rest of my things are in the center here so just the normal things I carry. I'll go from the front here. So here is my phone. As I said, the iPhone 11 Pro. In the corner here, over here, I have a mask. You can take those everywhere these days. And then I've got my Louis Vuitton uh, pochette, mini pochette. Fits perfect. I mean, it's there's so much room in there. Also got a Y pouch mini. So I do like to take those even when I'm by myself. I had to wipe myself off today. I've got something on me. I'm grot. <laughs> and then I've got two things right here next to each other. If you can see that because it's dark and they're, they're dark. Uh, this is a Louis Vuitton key pouch. I've got my keys in. And then this is my wallet at the moment. This is a Carry Kit Oprah. Uh, this is their old Oxblood color from ages ago. I actually have my other Louis Vuitton wallet in to have uh, something repaired on it. So I'm using this at the moment. This is really good. You can fit just fit cards and things in there. I don't take much cash or anything. So that was inside of there. It's almost the same color as the bag. That's why I kind of blended in. But that's, I mean, that's it. That's all I normally carry, but it kind of gives you an idea of how, you know, how much, how much room is in there. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed that little review and packing of the Coach Jade Messenger Bag. If you have any questions, please pop them down below. If you did enjoy this video, please consider giving me a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. If you guys have a wonderful day, st stay safe and healthy, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.